time after seven and a half years of waiting, Abby Williams and Libby German will finally have their day in court. The two teens were tragically murdered in Delphi back in 2017, a case that we've been following ever since that day. Richard Allen was arrested two years ago in connection with the murders and has been in custody ever since. Our Fox 59's Kit Hanley live right now outside of the Carroll County Courthouse walking us through what is happening actually outside of the courtroom right now and what we're expecting today. Kit, good morning. Yeah, hey guys, good morning. We are just an hour out from the doors opening here at the courthouse in Carroll County and two hours out from the start of opening statements. But I wanna show you what's been going on behind me here all morning long. You can see this line, it is long. All of these people here waiting and hoping to get a spot inside the courtroom. Now we know there are only 30 seats available to the public and there are more than 30 people waiting in line, but we're told that if they can't get in for the morning session, they may be able to get in for the afternoon session. I also wanna tell you that our team has been here all night long and three people in this line have been here since 8 30 p.m. This is a big deal to the Delphi community. This is a big deal to the two families. Now here's what you need to know about today. Opening statements in the case against Richard Allen will be presented to the court. Allen is charged with four counts of murder in connection with the February 2017 deaths of both Abby Williams and Libby German. The two were found near the Monon High Bridge where they went for a walk on a day off from school. Now yesterday the jury was sworn in consisting of eight women and four men plus another four alternates. All 16 are staying in a hotel just down the road in Lafayette and will be sequestered for the entire month-long trial with supervised access to their phones and families. Gull also heard from both the prosecution and defense on some outstanding matters facing the court prior to today. The defense withdrew its motion to allow the jurors to visit the crime scene. On the other hand, Judge Fran Gold took under advisement the prosecution's request to have the two original sketches excluded from the trial. Now, Gull will also allow guards and inmates to testify about Allen's behavior and comments made in prison. Now, once again, opening statements are set for 9 a.m. this morning with the courthouse doors opening here at 8 a.m. But I want to show you guys something really important here before we go. We're going to zoom in over here to these multicolored ribbons, blue and purple. Now, we're told these are both Abby and Libby's favorite colors. And this just serves as a very special reminder, very important reminder as to why we're all here today today and for the next month and it is to find some closure and to find some justice for these two young beautiful lives that were taken far too soon. For now reporting live in Delphi, Kit Hanley, Fox 59 News. Oh, Kit, thank you so much for the coverage and we will be following it all obviously all day long. Mm -hmm. Tight community there.